Hey Andre, so this video is just to kind of walk you through your first assignment for Canvas. So when you log into My USF, um, here you'll see the classes that you're enrolled in. So it looks like you got a uh, 8.30 class tomorrow. Um, for Canvas, you're going, going to go to the Learning and Teaching Tools and click on Canvas. And then your dashboard appears. This is going to show you, anything up here on the right is going to show you the to-do. So um, that's a really nice feature because it tells you what your upcoming assignments are and when they're due. So this is the one that you're going to work on today. It's due by 11.59 p.m. tonight. So um, you can click on it here and it will go directly to it or you can go into the classes. You could click on your online accounting concepts class and then it's still over here on the right as the to-do. So this is your instructor, her information, the office that she's in, so she's here on campus. So you want to definitely go over your syllabus first. So you can go ahead and click right there on the hyperlink. Um, this kind of gives you a calendar view of what's going to happen throughout the term, but if you click here, you can preview your syllabus as a Word document. So Definitely review this. This is your contract with your instructor. You know, you, you're going to know all the expectations for the course, what the objectives are. Sorry, I'm scrolling fast, but just going to go down and see if we've got, yeah, this is definitely what you want to look at. So the assignments, so the group project, the quizzes, and then really how much everything's worth. So this is really important to know. Um, so discussions are worth 20 points out of the 210. Um, so they're worth the, the least, which is usually how it goes in online classes. Your exams total 100 points, projects 60, quizzes 30, and so on. So review your syllabus. Um, and then you're going to go in here. We're going to go back just to, if you look on the left, all of these are your navigation. Oops, sorry. So you're just going to go to home. And then we're going to go back over here to the to-do list and click on that discussion. And this is where, um, like I said before, it's just where you introduce yourself. So you are going to post by clicking on that reply. And then this is where you're going to actually post your introduction about yourself. Um, so it says in the instructions, come back to the discussion board frequently and ch check your own initial post to reply to people that responded to you. So that's important. So posters sometime today and then sign on tomorrow and if anyone has replied to your post by asking you questions or just saying hello then make sure you reply to them. This self-introduction is what counts as your first week attendance policy so it has to be completed by tonight as though you are attending the class. So go ahead and write in this box you know you can just type everything out here. Hi. Um, a lot of times I suggest that students do this on a Word document just in case your Canvas times out and you type out a huge paragraph, you post it, and it says that you're not logged in. So go ahead and do it on a Word doc first and then just paste it in here. And then you just click Post Reply. So it's easy as that. Um, you'll also want to come in here and just like respond to some of your classmates. So you can do that by um, just replying down here. So this will continue the thread of conversation. You'll see this person introduced herself, and then this is the, your instructor. Um, so she kind of just made a couple comments, and then this is a fellow classmate. Um, so kind of relating to what she said about Taekwondo. Um, if you, you know, don't have anything really to say to Amy, you can just scroll down and see some another classmate that you feel like you could comment to. If you're an avid sports fan, maybe you want to comment to Steven. Um, so that's your assignment for today. So just go in here, make your initial post, reply to a classmate, and then come back tomorrow and make sure that um, you reply to anyone that has said anything to you. Especially it's nice to reply to your instructor. That way it shows that you are definitely interactive in your online class. All right. Um, so please let me know if you have any questions. Have a great day.